For today's lesson, we are going to learn about possessive pronouns. They are mine, yours, his, hers, ours, and theirs. These possessive pronouns show belonging to. Let's look at an example. Can you please read this sentence, Turbo Girl? 1. Turbo Boy's shoes are dirtier than my shoes. In sentence 1, we use the first-person personal pronoun, my, before the noun, shoes. So, the shoes belong to the speaker. And that's you, Turbo Girl. But when we use a possessive pronoun in a sentence, we do not write the noun after it. Please read sentence number two, Turbo Girl. Two. Turbo Boy's shoes are dirtier than mine. In this sentence, we use the possessive pronoun mine. We do not write the noun shoes after it. So, mine shoes will be incorrect. Alright, let's look at the other singular possessive pronouns. The first person possessive pronoun, mine, is used when the speaker is referring to himself or herself. For example, if Turbo Girl says, These books are mine, the possessive pronoun mine in the sentence refers to the speaker, who is Turbo Girl, and the books belong to Turbo Girl. We use the second person possessive pronoun yours when we are referring to the person we are speaking to. For example, if you tell Turbo Boy, these pencils are yours. Yours refers to Turbo Boy and it tells us that the pencils belong to him. We also use yours when we are talking to a group of people. For example, if I am talking to you, Turbo Boy and Turbo Baby, and I say, these cookies are yours. Yours refers to you, Turbo Boy and Turbo Baby. So, the cookies belong to all three of you. We use the third person possessive pronoun, his or hers, when we are referring to someone else. His is used for boys and men, and hers is used for girls and women. Please read the sentence, Turbo Girl. This toy aeroplane is his. The possessive pronoun his in the sentence refers to Turbo Boy, and it tells us that the toy aeroplane belongs to him. Please read the next sentence, Turbo Girl. My cake is smaller than hers. The possessive pronoun hers refers to the girl and it tells us that the bigger cake belongs to her. Okay, Turbo Girl, let's move on to the plural forms of possessive pronouns now. Ours is the plural form of mine. We use it when there are more than one speakers referring to themselves. For example, if you say, This turbo mobile is ours. The possessive pronoun ours in this sentence refers to turbo girl, turbo boy, and turbo baby. So we know that the turbo mobile belongs to all three of you. This is the plural form of his and hers. We use it when we are referring to more than one person. For example, you say, These footprints are theirs. The possessive pronoun theirs in this sentence refers to Turbo Boy and Turbo Baby, and it tells us that the footprints belong to them. For today's lesson, 
I've learned about the possessive pronouns mine, yours, his, hers, ours, and theirs. They show belonging to, and we do not add a noun after them. The singular first person possessive pronoun mine is used when the speaker is referring to himself or herself. For example, these books are mine. We use the second person possessive pronoun yours when we are referring to the person we are talking to. For example, these pencils are yours. We also use yours when we are talking to more than one person. For example, these cookies are yours. We use the third person possessive pronoun his or hers when we are referring to someone else. For example, this toy aeroplane is his. The possessive pronoun ours is the plural form of mine. We use it when there are more than one speakers referring to themselves. For example, this turbo mobile is ours. The possessive pronoun theirs is the plural form of his and hers. We use it when we are referring to more than one person. For example, these footprints are theirs. Well done, Tobogo.